Um, so what do you know about Islam? My brother, I've got a brother, he's got different dad, but his side of the family, they're all Muslims. So I've grown up with a little bit of religion, yeah. but I've never really... Okay, so, you know, um, we have five pillars in Islam. So you've heard about this? So, um, the first is is to recognize that Allah is the only one to worship, to worship, which is the whole point of what we want to do, yeah? So we have a thing where we have uh, affirmation and negation. So we say, there is no no one worthy of worship except Allah, or there's nothing worthy of worship except Allah, yeah? And Muhammad is his servant and messenger, his final servant of messengers, because we recognize all the messengers what came from uh, the beginning from Adam right up until Muhammad and everything caught in between. So that's the first thing that we we, we believe. Yeah? The second thing is the praying. We pray five times a day because that's what was prescribed to us. Yeah? And we find like if you do your research, you find that this was something that was happening before. Um, so a lot of time you'll hear the Muslims say, um, we're actually just um, uh, we're just continuing what was there before, but sometimes there's some minor changes, right? The second thing is that we give um, we give zakat, which means to just to give charity, which is two point uh, two point five percent of our excess wealth, right? Um, and me when I entered Islam, the main thing that I thought about is follow the money you know like if you look at uh some other communities you have a big person and they're driving in a big car and this and that money that they collected from us small guys no it's not that not like that you you give your charity to where you think it should go your hair causes you say i might want to give you might it might be your own family there might be somebody in your family needs needs that's charity right um so we dealt with uh there's a cut um fasting we fast uh, uh, once a year in the month of Ramadan yeah if you're able like there could be situations where you don't have to fast like if you're on your menstruation or if you're ill or something like that and then the last one is 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 Hajj making pilgrimage pilgrimage to Mecca and once again that says if you can if you can afford to if you have the physical ability so these are the five pillars so um, once we believe in these things, that's the first thing what enters, helps us to enter into Islam. Now we have a thing where we say six pillars of Iman, which means like uh, faith, belief. And there's some things that you, you, can't, you can't see, like I'm into Allah, I believe in Allah, yeah? It's just something that you know that there's a creator out there, you believe. Wa malaikati. We believe in the angels. We've never seen angels, yeah, but we, but we believe in angels, and we've got these from previous um, religions as well. Uh, what could to be the books? We believe in the books. We believe in the previous books, but we keep the last book, which is the pristine, because we know about the previous books where some of them have been changed. Uh, six pillar of Iman. Uh, well, Rusuli, right? Sorry, yeah. So, we believe in the, 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 the prophets, the messengers, what were sent starting from Adam and to the last, yeah. And, and as he was saying, it, and we believe in the last day, yeah. We believe in the last day, which is that we're going to be uh resurrected, we're going to be judged, yeah. And we believe in the Qadr, meaning um, predestinedly, uh, destiny. But we have free choice, we have the will, right? We're not forced into this, right? So, um, are you ready to accept Islam? Okay, so repeat after me. Uh, before I ask you, is anybody forcing you? No, this is from your own people. It's something I've always thought about. Yeah. But as of recently, I think recently, the past this year, yeah. it's coming to me extremely, and I feel like I need to free or, yeah. you know, I need to get closer yeah. to And nobody can force you because this is something has to be, yeah? It's like, like I said, I've grown up with uh, an influence around me, like I said, my brother, his yeah. family, they're all Muslims, so I've always had some sort of yeah. tight relations. Yeah, I, I, I can relate to that, yeah, yeah because they're, talking. yeah, and you know, I think some of that, what you're talking about, it, a lot of it can be explained. When you start re really uh, um, researching, you we have a thing we call fitra, 
which is your natural uh, inclination to worship the creator is something which is just there and so you can get these answers uh, why do i feel this kind of thing so repeat after me i bear witness that there's none worthy except allah and i bear witness that muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam oh, that okay that muhammad is his servant and his final messenger. Messenger. And we're going to repeat in Arabic. Is the brother gone? Okay. Repeat after me. Ashada. Allah. Ilaha. Illallah. Wa ashadu. Anna. Muhammad. Al Rasulullah. Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Takbir. The sister has become Muslim. I wish there was other sisters around you who could hug you and welcome you. Yeah? Sister, 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 what's it? Okay, she shy the camera. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Uh, so you, you say you've got a brother? Yeah. yeah. Does your brother live local? Yeah, yeah. Um, if there's, oh, if there's any chance we're here every Saturday, if he's passing by, it'd be good to have a word with him. Yeah, inshallah. I you guys when I was passing. It's funny, I got goosebumps. Yeah, mashallah. I was passing by a couple of weeks back and I was too shy to come over. That happens a lot. And I thought, no, you know, you need to not be, it's not anything to be shy about. Yeah, that's why we've been here for two and a half years and we've never missed, we've never missed a Saturday except that it was Eid for this very reason because we know that some people, they want but I mean, this cameras can be a bit overwhelming, yeah, right? Some of them not even on, right? But you plucked up the carriage, and now, now you're Muslim. Actually, um, I want to give you a website. Please, uh, anything as small as you know, I've been doing my own little research. And yeah. I was thinking you know, even in terms of praying, I don't know how to pray. And I saw on the internet, they've got, um, it's a prayer mat now, but it teaches yeah. you how to pray the right. We've, we've actually got some videos that we've been sending out. Yeah. yeah. So first we're going to bid salam to our brothers.